To balance this equation, mg plus CO2 yields MgO plus C. Let's first count up the atoms on each side of the equation. On the reactant side, we have one magnesium, we have one carbon, and then we have the two oxygen atoms. On the product side, we have one magnesium, we have, let's do the carbon, one carbon, and then one oxygen. So everything is balanced except the oxygen. So let's try to fix the oxygen. I could put a two in front of the MgO and that would balance the oxygens. We have one oxygen here times the two, that would equal two. But we have the two applies to everything here. So we have one magnesium times the two. And that means we have two magnesium atoms. All right, so we fixed the oxygens. Now we have two magnesiums. We need to have two on this side as well. And one times two, that gives me two. So I'm gonna put a coefficient of two here. So one times the two, that gives me two. And now the magnesium atoms are balanced and we're done. This equation is balanced. So that's the balanced equation for magnesium plus carbon dioxide yields magnesium oxide plus carbon. It's really an awesome reaction. You take a block of dry ice, which is frozen carbon dioxide, and you light some magnesium metal on fire, it burns very hot. And when you put it in the dry ice, put it between a sandwich of two pieces, you'll actually have a really dark carbon when you're done. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.